Hello everyone, it's been a minute. So I decided to try my phone using the normal light because I've been seeing people using it and I don't know if it actually works. Even though some people failed. And I know that in mass I have to make sure of the rice. You have to make sure the rice you're using is certified rice. <laughs> Mostly the pushing cup and two that we know. So I decided to try it out. I used three cups of white rice. I washed and soaked it for 12 hours. And then I used half cup of rice, cooked rice. Here I was washing the cooked rice because I boiled it and it was too hot. I cannot add it to the yeast. If not, it's going to kill the yeast. So I made sure I washed it. And normally I use soya beans in my masa because I don't know how the yogurt. If you have yogurt, you can use yogurt and kamwa or baking powder. But I do not like using baking powder in my masa personally because I feel like it's it comes out too soft and the butter becomes too foamy and I do not like my masa to be foamy. This is my opinion. You can use it if you want to. But if you are going to use the baking uh, baking powder, make sure you don't use the soya beans because I've never mixed them together. So here everything was going left because the butter is too thick. It was too thick. I was adding so much water but it was still too thick. So finally after like adding three cups of water it was now stable to be blended smoothly and then after this I added um, a tablespoon of yeast then I waited for some minutes the reason I added this was because I felt like the other yeast I used was was deactivated due to the heat but after this I, I totally forgot about the yeast like I allowed it to rise for at, at least two hours I think almost two hours I do not like my butter looking this way so yeah I don't like the foamy butter so I decided to stop frying So here yeah, I had high hopes because it was looking so good after putting it in the pan. But that's what happened. I was totally disappointed in the masa and the rice, especially. So I feel like you shouldn't use normal purpled rice. Like you should know what you're putting yourself. Not all purpled rice can make masa. So you should know that once your recipe is filled, don't blame the recipe you're following. It's probably from your rice or some of the ingredients you use. But for my own, it was the rice. I knew that. So... The tip I have for you when trying to make masa is first you have to look for a good twin shinkaf, shinkaf and two, a good shinkaf and two would will yield a perfect masa for you because you can go through my page and see the masa I have been I posted two years ago I think. And I also sell masa so I make sure to get the not the new you know there is newly harvested Shankafan tour and there is the old one so I use the old one because my heart feels at peace when using it because I don't want to take chances because I once used the newly harvested and it also failed so this was it immediately and this was it the next day so I think 12 to 18 hours after it was now looking this way yeah 
thank you so much please don't forget to subscribe. and write your thoughts in the comment section below thank you